Hello everyone, I'm Sir Belize, and welcome back to another episode of Skyrim Legends where Corgo and Carrie were about to head into a cave. However, I was informed that this cave has to do with the Dawn Guard, and so for now, we're going to leave it untouched as I know that certainly Corgo will be interested in the Dawn Guard. Yeah, killing vampires is awesome. <laughs> yeah, I suppose it is. Well, I guess Carrie and Corgo, or Corgo and Carrie, can go ahead and move up this mountain now. We might find something else, something maybe even more interesting. Well, I guess we'll see in time then. Alright, off we go. So much to see, so much to kill as usual. Well, there's not too much to see right now, just snow and mountain, but I'm sure in time we'll come across something. Man, I cannot imagine climbing a mountain like... Oh, hello, a bear trap. Huh. And there's another trail here with a lot more bear traps as well. I wonder what they're trying to trap. Maybe that is a sign that we shouldn't go up here. Nope, I'm going. Yeah, I know, Corbell. <laughs> what? Is that a body? No, it's just a piece of wood. Oh, or rocks, not even wood. <laughs> Alright. Well, let's keep going up now. Maybe I should be a little bit worried, but then again, we did it. We did find that camp last time, right by that cave, and it had a few dead animal bodies, or at least one, and I believe two pelts or three pelts at the very most, and so that would have belonged to a hunter. Now, I'm not sure who lives up here. Huh. Oh, thanks, Carrie. Okay. I'm going to have to find a new companion at some point, not because I'm growing tired of Carrie, but just because I do believe that bringing in as many people as you can to share thoughts with and, well, your life with is always a positive notion, at least in most situations. Now, what is over here? Have I ever been here? I have no clue. I know Corgal ha hasn't been here, so in time he'll go find out and see what is going on. He's very cold at this moment, which means that he'll have to find a campfire or even make one, but I believe we can go inside over here. As you can see, it's getting a bit blurry for Corgal just because he's very cold right now. Oh yeah, we're going to have to find our way inside. Bloodlet Throne? Discovered? What is that? <laughs> I don't like that name whatsoever. Oh, can we go inside from up here? We cannot, but we can go in inside. Oh, <laughs> hey, Gary. She likes to move fast. We can't go in through here. Maybe down here, then. I found some firewood. It's chopped. So apparently, someone lived here. Or lives here. <laughs> Alright, well, let me check my map real quick. Yeah, we're really far away. And now, we're going to find out what is within. The Bloodlet Throne. Huh. I'm sure it's not good. Here we go. Okay, well, this location is looking rather interesting. I see a trap plate down there, so let's not go over that. Uh, oh, Gary's not here. Alright. Huh. Looks like you'll be doing this alone, Corbell. No problem. I got this. Hey. Yeah, oh, great. Vampire's my favorite. Huh, what are they doing? Are they over here? Oh, they are. Don't worry. Oh, hey, Carrie. Bye. Ah, nasty business to these vampires. Looks like they're not too strong uh, overall. And Carrie's really, really powerful. Jeez, girl. You frighten me from time to time. Okay, let's go ahead and loot these creatures then. I'll take the stake. I'm not sure why I would take a stake from a dead body, but sure, I'll go with it. Alright, magic potion. I'll take all of that, actually. Sorry, lady. Uh oh. I don't like the look of those statues. Hopefully, they're just statues. Please be statues, come on. Alright, Carrie, looks like we're gonna have a little bit of fun in time. No vampires down here, thankfully. Oh, jeez! Okay. I'm gonna kill it! Oh god, I hate it! Oh boy. Yeah, that is one nasty creature. Wow. Look at it! Fortunately, Carrie has your back here. Wait, the other one, will it come to life here? Moonstone ore. Wow. It's horrifying. What about that one? I'm gonna hit it. Take that! Huh. Nothing so far. Not as bad as I thought. Maybe you were a bit preemptive to utilize your rage. Nope, I'm always angry. You know what I mean. <laughs> Let's see. Do we open this door over here? Yeah, we can. Oh, it's barred from the other side. Okay. Well, for now, that gargoyle can leave us alone. 
hopefully. <laughs> Let's move on out. I wonder if I drop a torch there if it would cause that uh, to catch on fire. That would be interesting overall. Oh, a few more vampires, huh? It's a bit dark. Hi! Whoa. She was really not much. Then again, she was a fledgling, so clearly she's not going to be very powerful at all. I'll take the dust, though. I can sell that or use it for... Oh, a candlestick. Sure. Let's check out what they have here. It's almost a little bit creepy. Thanks for singing that ballad. Ugh. By thanks, I mean, please stop. Alright, bone mill. I won't still. I don't do such things. I'll take the potions, though. That will work out nicely. What's in here? Not too much. Oh, yeah, I guess that's uh, some good eating there. Let's look over here now. Any books that I could use for the future? And by use, I mean, well, I guess extract knowledge from them? From these pages? Oh, what a nice knife. I could take it, but I don't want to. I can see it a little bit better now. There's really not too much in here from what I can tell. Nothing really valuable outside of the potions that I could clearly use in the future. I wonder what, what weapons do I have right now? Anything interesting? Only a pickaxe. Okay. I might pick up a few new weapons. An iron ore. Dane. <laughs> to be specific about it. Alright. Uh oh. Well, I found some more friends again. Man, I'm so popular. Hey, I'm gonna show you my new toy. Well, it's not new. Hey! Hey! What are you doing? Whoa! Okay, Corgo. You should probably not charge in again. What? Yeah, I know. Let's get him a little bit more health there. It looks like your skills overall have been decreased by quite a large margin. Alright, 47. It looks like I won't be able to get too much. Now, I feel as though Korgal is a very intimidating character, so he would actually have skills within speech over here. I mean, come on, he's a towering orc. Oh, there, there we go. There's one gone. Whoa, she went flying. Here's another one. Oh, that was really deadly overall. They're catching up on fire as they die. That's interesting. A still war axe. I might try that out in time. No, not really my thing. Okay, let's see. Uncommon taste. No, thank you. And Carrie is learning some new spells, I believe. Let's see. The bear of Markarth. Oh, there's another one. Ah, she'll be here eventually. Let's see. Oh, the wolf scared me. I don't know why it did. What are you doing here, Wolf? Stop that. Oh, there's a real vampire. Not a little pansy one. Come on. There we go. One gone. There's another one. Nasty business they are. Well, dead. Or, I guess, re-dead business they are. I could take your armor as well. I'll go ahead and do that. What about you? Flawless Garnet. Oh, man, another... Oh, dear. Let's block for a moment. Oh, that was close. <sighs> Alright, uh, I'll take that, and then I'll take... Uh, okay, I'll take this and that. That should do for the moment. Carrie, you're really gonna... Oh, man, I'm not liking this whatsoever. Hey! Oh, what's worse than a vampire? What's that? This. Oh, it's anchors. You should probably go help out Carrie! Oh. It's even more powerful than the previous one, really. I hope you got this... Ah, uh, you barely do, friend. Plentiful healing. I'll take this as well. Oh, that's a nasty creature it is. Come on now. Almost there. Alright. Wait, you're being shot at. By, by what? They don't stop. This location is really a challenge overall. I'm guessing it has to do with the Dawn Guard as well. My mistake. Uh, maybe Korgal needs a shield. We killed so many down here. The dead body over there as well. Come on, Korgal. Don't have time for this. Oh, it's a thrall. Okay. Poor thrall. Now it's dead. You can put out of your misery. Huh. You feel chilly. You begin to warm up. Fantastic. Yeah, I know you miss him, but we're a little bit preoccupied. You can talk about that later, lady. A skeleton eye probably shouldn't be in the water. It's <laughs> very cold. Nothing else is there, though. Okay, let's move on now. I'm not very keen on moving on. If I could find a bed to sleep in, we could. If Carrie takes a watch, we could, we could at least rest for a time. What's in here? Garlic? Huh. 
Would that do anything? I have no clue. I mean, I don't think it would be here if it could. There's a wolf. I'll take the wolf pelt. And a dead one over here. Alright, let's just keep moving on. You have nothing that I want. An iron dagger. I don't need that. What's over here? Another dead one. A Khajiit. Poor thing. Alright, woodcutter's axe. I don't need that. Arcane enchanter. Nor do I need that. Here's another ash pile. I assume it was a thrall or something else, really. A lot of bodies are here. Wow. Really, really deadly. A goat hide. And that vampiric text is still on my screen. <laughs> Whoa. I don't like the look of this place whatsoever. Oh, what are you... Come on, it's not time to take a squat right now. It's rude. We'll search the end table. Some charcoal, I don't need that. Okay, alchemy lab. What else do we have? I'll take the potion just to sell for later. Thank you, Carrie. I appreciate that, really. Alright, a few more potions, or at least one more. I begin to warm up, or Corbal does. I can't open that up for the moment. Oh! I guess they all lived here. Let's look in that chest real quick. A copper and da 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 da. Lesser soul gem. Incident at Necrom. I've never seen that. I'll take it. Iron dagger of fatigue. Scroll of blizzard. And a lot of stuff over here. Scroll of fury. Let's see white cap. Chest over here. All right, we've done all that we need to for the moment in that room. What else can we find while well, here? See, there's a bed, we so we could rest, certainly. There's a lot of potions and scrolls here. I I really am going to make a lot of money from coming here. Ugh, that's gross. Alright, what's up here now? Vernicus and Barlor. I've got your back. Huh, a troll skull as well. I need troll fat, but not, not a skull. There's another scroll. <laughs> not a skull, but a scroll. Alright. Let me look over here as well. No dead bodies are no bodies are in there. I guess we can move on and find out what is lurking within this cavern. Something unpleasant, no doubt. That's a given though. Can we go over here? What is over here? We would fall. Do I really want to fall in there? I really don't want to. And I just fought here. But this also leads wait, that vampire is being attacked or tortured? What's going on? I guess we'll find out. Gary, you need to be over here, girl. Okay, we found a room of friends then. That's gonna be fun. Looks like they're waiting for us to go fight them. That's deadly. What do I have here that I could wear? Forsworn boots, I do not need that. Wielding, I do not need that either. I need none of this for the moment. Minor stamina, resist magic is a bit more vital at this time. Sure, grip. I have a lot of potions. What could I use? Enhanced stamina. I'll take that, certainly. Strength. I don't need that. Let's see. Potion of the Defender. I'll take that. And I believe that's all that I'll use for the time being. I don't use poison. Okay, let's pull the chain down. Hi! I think you should. At least right now. Oh! Wolves! Oh man, he's like my best friend then. They're called death hounds, so that's a bit more deadly, I think. Well, Carrie has your back for the moment. Oh, they're deadly. Really deadly. Okay. Let's see. I'll take that. And this over here as well. Hopefully Carrie can really help you out a little bit more. These things are really just an abomination overall. There you go, Carrie. Is that it? Is that all he has? I believe we can go after him now. Sick him, girl. Just kidding. Oh, she, she might kick your face in for that one. There's one more. Go ahead and check what you can find on these bodies down here. L. I need it. Oh, great. Mercenary boots, iron war axe. I don't need that. What about a bandit? Oh! Hello. Only a, that death hound. Take it out. You got it. What do they have? A collar. 
Really? In dog meat? Gross. I, m I might eat it, really. That's disgusting. Oh, a master vampire, huh? I hope you can take out that creature. Where did Kiri go? She should be here right now. You're doing quite well, but still. Take the potion, friend. Looks like so far, Corbel has that. We only have the fledgling left, so we took out their most powerful combatants here. <sighs> An antique iron sword. I don't need that either. I'll take this, though. I can sell it. Vampire boots. <laughs> Neat. Master vampire. I still... Wakizashi. I'll take it. Vampire armor again. Gross. Alright. Let's move up here. There might be some treasure. Certainly so. Let's see. Nice chair. <laughs> Hell to king, baby. I'm feeling pretty good about this place. Oh well. Okay, let's get moving. What is that over here? That lever? Ah, yeah, okay. Let's see, what should we do? I find it curious that they would build that contraption and really not have that much other technology. Alright, I, I believe we may have cleared out that throne room. That was the bloodlet throne, I assume. We've killed all that we need to kill here. Let's see. What's over here? Circlet of archery. That's very powerful. An orc war axe of weariness. Interesting. Really, a lot of money has been made here. I hope we don't have to deal with that gargoyle again. Or the other gargoyle. Ugh. Oh boy. Easy there, gargoyle. I'm just leaving. You can have your friend back. Yep. Come on, get over here. Uh, uh. Ah, forget it. Huh. You ugly. Alright. Let's get out of here now. We've done our part. We've done maybe too much, even. Okay. Now we can move on. We've killed all the vampires. At least I hope so. Oh. Oh. Oh, dear. Sorry. Hey, how could... Ugh. Time to go. Alright, friends. Well, we have, com we have completed our adventure for right now, so I'm going to go ahead and see all of you later. Until then...